time to go for snorkeling. Let's go. I'm going to spend the entire afternoon here. <laughs> Southeast Asia. For last many years, we were thinking that Thailand would be too crowded or maybe too overhyped. Let's just avoid that destination. But man, it has so much to offer for every traveler. So here we come, Thailand, the most awaited trip since last few years. This is quickly showing our itinerary in this trip. Our target destination here is Phuket first. Instead of taking flight directly to Phuket, we took one quick overnight break in Bangkok to explore the street markets and I wanted to grab something quickly, the dresses I mean, to wear during the trip. We took early morning flight from Bangkok to Phuket. In Phuket, we stayed in the most luxurious resort by B Villas which is near Ayo Yon Beach towards secluded part of Phuket. You will see more glimpses of its open pool and sunset evening in the next video. We are on an island hopping trip to explore Phi Phi and nearby islands in Thailand. Start a trip from Sea Angel Cruise meeting point near Phuket city. In the last video, we explored Monkey Bay and Koh Phi Phi Island. In this video, the plan is to explore world famous Viking Cave, Pai Le Lagoon, Maya Bay, and then lastly to Khai Nai Island for a beautiful sunset. Continuing our Fifi Island hopping day trip, next destination was to reach Phi Le Lagoon. From photos and aerial shots, it looks quite an amazing spot to enjoy the beauty of nature here. We are just in front of the cave. Uh, I don't think going inside is allowed. There are some construction work going on from the government side. Uh, but yeah, the landscapes are amazing here. The blue water and the overall vibe, it's amazing. Closer to the islands, turquoise sea and mesmerizing landscapes became so amazing and I was getting more and more excited for my pre-booked long tail boat ride in the lagoon. Still wanna come over Cause I know 
This is amazing. Look, so you have to take the long tail boat when you are going to Phi Phi Island. Basically, it's I won't say it's overhyped because it gives you those perfect pictures and they take you through the different islands, landscapes, and the turquoise blue color or the green sea. So it looks so so beautiful. So look at me. I'm taking so many pictures and videos. And right now, what we are going to do? We are carrying our snorkeling gear so we will just jump into the sea to do snorkeling again and then take more pictures up okay enough of pictures it's time to go for snorkeling let's go Colorful, so vibrant, so beautiful, and what else? I mean, uh, I'm really loving my vacation here in Thailand. Especially every every location in Southeast Asia. We are going to explore more and more. Watch this video series of Thailand. I'm sure that you are going to love Thailand series as much as you have shown love in the Bali series. But yes, more from the beach destination. Last many years, we were thinking that Thailand would be too crowded or maybe too overhyped. Let's just avoid that destination. But man, it has so much to offer for every traveler, for every kind of budget. Whether you are traveling with your friends, families, kids, partners, I mean, it's amazing. And the look at the landscapes here. After so much fun at Phile Lagoon, we headed to the other side of the island to explore beach at Maya Bay. For that, we have to arrive at Lo Sama Bay and walk across the island and arrive at the beautiful beach and spectacular view of Maya Bay. Bay right now it was closed for some time it opened just two months back so you know people love to come here it's very peaceful very pretty I mean it's very very pretty I don't know it's the weather or it's actually this pretty place look here
finally to the last spot of the day, Kainai Island. It's a very tiny island, but it's very pretty one. People do come here. This is our last stop for today. And then we will go back to Phuket. And oh, there are so many colorful umbrella. Maybe we'll take one and sit and just relax for a bit. Enough of activities for today. <laughs> Great time to enjoy the beach here on the small island maintained by the local people here. It won't take much time to walk around the island, have fresh drink, relax and chill by the beach. There are a lot of water sports options here. One can enjoy them at their own expense. and sunbeds here so you can choose to sit here as well and relax for an hour or two whatever timing your boat finalizes so um, in this island uh, there are many activities that you can do probably some people are going into the water some people going for the jet, jet scooter yes it's a very small island very tiny island as I have mentioned previously and he finally having his beer oh. Not not my my kind of trip. Too yes. much running from island to island. Too much running from island to island, and it was like a shared boat, so we oh, had but to. It was not like commercial one. I liked it. Yeah, I mean, if you have to go in uh, like in such trip, then we had the like the best uh, company with whom we went for the trip. They were very particular about the timing, about the safety, and about the instructions, about everything. But if you ask us personally, then we, we prefer to sit somewhere for long hours and not just hop on from one island to another island. But this is like a different kind of experience and I, and I hope you all enjoyed watching our experience and enjoyed watching this video. And he has been working like really hard, so he deserves the beer. And my cocktail, Mai Tai, it's really really good in this tiny island. It's so it's good. Large beer. Yeah, <laughs> finally the large beer, and we have some fruits from the boat. Savvy, uh, savvy kind of snacks. Yes, it's pineapple and watermelon, my favorite. I love to stay in tropical countries because I love the fruits and, <laughs> of course, love the weather there. Uh, but yes, soon we'll have to go back to Delhi, and it will be really, really cold after we go back. So I'm, I'm like a bit worried. And here we are, we are going to chill for one hour and soon it will be sunset but I guess we will return before the sunset time. Uh, as I mentioned that they are very particular about the timing. By 5.15 or 5.10 we will probably have to go back to the boat. All the boats are waiting there. almost sunset when we reached back with the scenic view of rustic fishing boats over the sunset colors. And here at arrival we got to know that the crew has clicked some amazing pics of you throughout the trip. And you can collect them here by paying a reasonable price or call it a tip for the efforts made by the crew. And after that it was time for us to go back to our luxurious stay V Villas Phuket which is coming in the next video. So that's all about it, the Phi Island tour. It was like great, full of activities. I did not even know the entire day passed by so quickly. Okay, so now it's time to say goodbye. So they will drop us back to the hotel. So uh, just check it out, though we are late. We will miss the sunset, not sure what to experience there, but it's cool.
but when 